Today at noon, hearts are breaking after Hoosiers learn that a little girl with bright blue eyes and this sweet smile won't be coming home. Everybody now wondering, why would anyone want to harm Shaylin Ammerman? The girl's body was discovered in Gosport, Indiana, about 10 miles from her home in Spencer. That grim discovery has now turned a missing persons case into a criminal investigation. There is a suspect in custody with connection with this little girl's death. Rich Van Wyke is back in Spencer, Indiana today. He's talking with authorities, trying to figure out what happened to Shaylin. Rich? Scott, this morning I spoke with Shaylin and Emerson's mother, grandmother and also her father. They are racked with grief, there is anger, and they also have lots of questions that at this point no one has answers to. The home that Shaylin disappeared from is still a crime scene. Across town, the man accused of taking this little girl is locked in the Owen County Jail. He's facing preliminary charges. 22-year-old Kyle Parker is facing charges of obstruction of justice, failure to report a dead body, and improper disposal of a corpse. State police are at the crime scene this morning. It's about 10 miles from here, just outside the small town of Gosport. Early last night, police discovered the girl's body near the banks of the White River and Indian Creek. The area is accessible only by a private road. Parker, the family says, was a family friend, trusted enough to spend the night in their home. Shaylin's father, Justin Ammerman, says Perry was there when everyone went to sleep, and when they woke up Wednesday morning, he was gone, and so was the girl. I just want to know why. Why this man would come into my house and take my daughter and do the most terrible thing in the world. I want to remember my daughter of her smile, her giggling. She did this at me all the time, waving, and she... She liked to dance. Yes, she liked to dance. Every, any kind of music you played, she was dancing. The Owen County prosecutor expects Parker will be in court Monday. The courts in this county are closed today, Scott, because it is Good Friday. Hey, Rich, I want to ask you uh, next steps. Uh, has an autopsy happened yet on this little girl? We are told the autopsy is underway, Scott, in Louisville. That autopsy is going to be very important. If the coroner determines a cause of death or recovers any other evidence uh, from this little girl and also confirms the identity of the little girl, it is very likely that additional charges could be filed in this case. And that story is uh, something we're going to be monitoring very closely out of uh, Spencer today. Thank you, Rich.